How's it going, Laser Bruce? This is up, Bobby Six Killer, and welcome to a demo for a game called Carto. Now, this is a game that's going to be coming out at the end of October. I believe it's penciled in for October 27th at this stage, but it is a game that is published by Humble Publishing, or Humble Games, whatever you want to call it. Um, and it looks really interesting. It looks uh, like a puzzle, explorey, open. I don't really know exactly. But it's basically a game where you are uh, collecting map pieces and fitting them in like a jigsaw puzzle to get around which looks really cool so let's get into the demo here and if we really like it then we'll play the full version when that comes out in the end of october let's see what happens anyway it looks like it's pretty narratively focused which is fine by me as you know open the map welcome explorer this world is yours to change you can move any piece of the map and rotate pieces as needed it'll be rb you can connect pieces with the same type of border. Shaded pieces of the map are lands you haven't explored yet. Go check them out. So, do I have a piece of map? Oh, so I can do that. And then I can explore it. Good. You found a new piece of the map. Good. Connect new pieces of the existing map to reveal more of the world. Pieces of the map have been scattered everywhere. The more you find, the bigger your world will grow. There's not a lot of sound effects here. Where's the sound effects at, yo? If we stick that there... No? Hmm. I see. So we can just pop that like that. Okay. Makes sense to me. Now we can check this piece out. There's a man. Is that a new piece of map? All right, is that a piece of map or is... Oh, let's have a look. Let's have a look. Yeah, that's a piece of map, all right. right. We can put it anywhere. Let's just chuck it there then. And talk to this man. Hello. Ahoy there, little one. We don't get new visitors very often. Your family with you. I see. Well, no matter. All are welcome here. And your timing is fortunate. For today we celebrate the coming of age of my dearest niece. Shannon. Yes, this is very exciting. I was so distracted this morning that I forgot my bait. But no matter, it won't be long now until the ceremony. Feel free to explore the island in the meantime, and I'll see you there. Well, we got a new area to explore, so we better do that. People! Hi, sweetie. Where'd you come from? It's exciting to meet someone new. I've barely left the house in months. This little bundle of love keeps me pretty busy. Did you meet my husband already? He's fishing nearby. Though he's probably not catching much. That big lug left without any bait this morning. I guess we'll just have to rely on the winds of the ocean, as we always have. Good thing this little ladybug likes fish. Not like that filthy little fuss pot over there. Hey, have you visited the other families yet? Callan and her family were the first ones to come to this island. They live right on the sea. Sia is my sister-in-law. She lives in the forest with her family. Her daughter Shiannon's coming of ages today. I can't believe it's here already. All right, crazy kid. Rargh, who are you? Are you 15? Mama said I have to be 15 before I can have my coming of age. If you're not 15, then how'd you cross the sea? When someone turns 15, a boat arrives at the northern pier. A gift from the sea. The 15 year old has to get in the boat and leave the island. Forever. I want to leave forever. That's like a month. <laughs> or possibly a little bit more. We have a piece of map. I can't put it there because of the, uh, the shape of it all. Let's do that then. How's that? That looks pretty nice to me. And we got another piece of map. Okay, good. Keep looking. We're heading into the forest. Or possibly not. <laughs> what have we got here? Okay, that looks good. That looks good. We're building our own map as we go. I like it. It's very cutesy. Hmm. Oh no, you don't look familiar. I must really be lost. I don't know if it's a small island, but I always get distracted on the way home. The ocean's just so beautiful. And full of mermaids. This is a bit embarrassing, but uh, could I trouble you to help me home? You seem to know your way around. My house is east of the one on the grassland, along the sea. Now if I can only figure out which way was east. There is no east. Like that? Ah. 
Oh, yes, yes, this looks familiar. That's my house, and that lady must be my wife. Wow, what luck. Thank you for your help, sweet child. You don't even know your wife? Hello there. Thank you for helping my husband home. I love him, but he'd forget his nose if it wasn't attached to his face. I don't think I've seen you here before. Are you from another tribe? What are your traditions? Our people are pioneers of the sea. Once we set sail, we settle on the first island that we find. We feel so lucky that it was this one. We just love it here. Have you met Shiannon yet? She's very special to us, it'd be hard to say goodbye, but we're excited for her. I'm sure she'd like to meet you, if you get the chance. I'm sure we will. We got a piece of map. Okay, it's forest on one side, and dirt on the other side. Can we... Now don't poo-poo this just yet. <laughs> Can we put it there? And then put this here. Like that. Not bad. Not bad. Oh, you again. Psst. Are you looking for she... Shiannon? She lives in a forest way bigger than this one. Well, I'll just make it bigger then. Wait, I guess that's what I have to do, right? Um, oops, wrong button. This one. There you go. Is that a bigger forest? An unremarkable pile of dirt. Lovely. Is there another map piece that we missed? Perhaps? Well, I can't make it any bigger than what it is now until I can find another map piece. Hmm. Oh, hello. Ah, more forest. Now we're talking. Maybe I put this back. Put that like that, and put that like that. There we go. Nice. This is cool. This is a very interesting idea. Haven't seen anything like this before. Shiannon. That girl. Oh, we can go inside. Ahem. <coughs> can I help you, kid? This is private property, you know. Sorry, it's been a tough few days with Shiannon. You're really very welcome here. He's a grumpy looking man. Ah, <sighs> Shiannon keeps saying that she'll return after she sets sail. But that's not our way. It's not the will of the sea. Once our people set sail, they must never return to their origin. It's tradition. I know, dear. That girl really boils my blood sometimes. But she's always done things her own way. How is there anyone on the island if everyone has to leave when they're 15? I wonder where she gets it from. I'm sure this is hard for her too. We'll just have to try and enjoy our time left together. Shiannon probably went to the lake to be alone. Can you please check on a young one? You seem like a good listener. Hmm. <clears throat> My wife and I built this house and everything in it. We're pretty handy. In fact, I'll even give you the grand tour. This is the living room, master bedroom and kitchen. And we're done. <laughs> Lovely. Hmm. <clears throat> Did you check out all of our fine craftsmanship? It is said that the animal, this animal dwelled on our ancestors' island. I bet it's called a black bear. Or a Blair, for short. It's hard to believe there are animals that big. I'd love to see one. A Blair. Seashell necklace. Inside one of the glowing shells you find a piece of the map. Yeah. Some exquisite clay pots. So that's what you wanted me to find, the map, right? This is a piece of the yeah. app. There's a piece of the lake. There's a piece of the lake. Is there any map bits over here? Nope. <laughs> Where's Shiannon then? Uh, I'm just not ready to leave. I know it's tradition, but my family's all I have. Why can't I come back and visit them after I've set sail? Our people have had that tradition for so long, I bet they've forgotten why they do it in the first place. Not all traditions are good, you know. Sometimes we do them just because it's what we've always done. Most of the time. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm just upset. Thank you for listening. Who might you be? Oh, no need to be nervous. I'm Shannon. Welcome to our island. I'm about to leave it forever, though. My coming of age ceremony is today. I guess part of me is excited, but I'm scared that I'll be lonely out there. It might take me a while to make new friends. And adventures are always more fun with someone else. I know, I just met you, but would you maybe want to come with me? You look like you'd be a good friend. We can build a new map. Wow, really? This is going to be so much fun, I can't wait to tell my parents. What about your family? Do you need to tell them too? <laughs> well then, 
We'll just have to go find them. There's one last thing I need to do before we set sail. Maybe you can help me? I always want to have my home close by, so I need a good handful of soil to bring with us. I just need a bit more time to say goodbye to this island. Can you please find some soil for me? You can find the best soil where the forest, the coastline, and the grassland meet. When you find it, can you please put some in this bag for me? Thanks. Didn't we see some over here? Scoop, scoop, scoop. There you go. Piece of cake. We already had that made. If not, we'd have to make, rearrange everything, I guess. Did you find some soil? This soil looks great, thanks. Hmm, there's a strange scrap of paper buried in it. Yes! Oh, do you want it? All yours. I think that was the last thing I did, but I'm ready to set sail. The high seas will be no match for us. Shannon and... Kato. Shannon and Kato. Woo! If you want to get ready, I'll meet you at the North Pier for my ceremony. Yay! This is the North Pier then? Alright, let's go. I'm assuming that's the end of the demo. This is like the first level then, and then we're leaving with her to onto the next level. May I speak with you, child? Ahem. <clears throat> May I ask you a favour? Please take this memento with you. And if you meet my son somewhere out there, give it to him. The odds are low, but I'll take any chance I get to send him our love. Good idea. We made it. Just in time for the dog show. Oh my god, that goes an idiot. May, you, may the sea bless your voyage with happiness. Shannon's so lucky to have a friend like you. Hmm, I suppose it's time. I hear that you'll be joining Shannon. That's very kind of you. I'm really gonna miss Shannon. Who will help me reel, in the, reel the nets in? I'm so proud of her though. And good for you for going with her. Honey, look, the boat is Shannon's gift from the sea. It always feels like magic when they appear. It sounds like magic. That boat is awesome. I could definitely use some claws though. I could definitely use some claws. Hey, Cardo. I can't believe the boat really came. I guess I'm ready to go. What about you? Yep. Woo, let's get the ceremony started. My dearest, a parting gift for you. A necklace made from swordfish bones. May it bring you peace and perseverance. And accompany you day and night. My beautiful daughter. Close your eyes and feel the gentle embrace of the wind. May you find your destiny just as we found ours. We love you, Shannon. Look at that moustache, though. <laughs> Thank you, everyone, for your blessing. I've come of age and the world awaits. We'll be right back. Shannon, stop with that nonsense. She's just kidding, dear. <laughs> She's so cheeky. Say hi to the lobsters. That poodle is talking. Farewell, everyone. We'll see you later. <laughs> Come on, Kato. Let's ride these waves. Are we gonna surf? <laughs> Screw the boat, we're gonna surf. Alright, well that's the uh that's the demo, so let me know go let me know what you guys think in the comments below. If you wanna see the full version of that when it comes out. Looks pretty interesting to me. Pretty cash. But pretty interesting nonetheless. Probably have a big long storyline which will be cool to see as you meet people along the way and all that. I like it. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out with me and I'll see you in the next one.